Um, let me take my glasses off. Oh no, I can't see, sorry. Put them back on. So this is a long awaited video that I've been planning on doing and I've low key been putting off because I know it's gonna take a lot of work. Basically, I'm going to transform myself and do a glow up from home. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hello if you're new here, my name is Bells. I'm not even talking that loudly, but basically it's time to transform myself. I've been letting my nails grow out. I've been letting my eyebrows grow out. I've been letting my hair grow out. Uh, if you know me, you know I am a high maintenance babe. I like my nails done, my hair done. I like a wax. I like to be tanned. Some people be like, what, you're black? But yeah, I like to be tanned. And, um, yeah, I just like to be smooth and looking good and I will pay a pretty penny for it. So I really done like last year my holiday prep routine. I thought I was going to do one this year. I kind of did it and it stopped. So what we're going to do is we're going to do my nails. We're going to take the acrylic off and I think I'm going to do press-ons. We're going to do my hair. We're going to do a different hairstyle. I have ordered a bunch of things from Amazon and I'll link them down below for those of you that want to do something with your hair. I'm kind of excited, kind of scared because I like think people doing things for me. So it's going to be interesting doing it all myself. So firstly, we're going to start with my brows. I think I'm going to remove the hair on my brows okay i never do my brows myself but a lot of people have just been using hair removal cream on their brows and then just tweezing what they need to do after then i'm going to put the eyebrow cream everywhere where it, all around the outline we're going to take our brush and our hair cream i'm using beet this is not a tutorial do this at your own risk but i'm using v this is the one for sensitive skin i'm really familiar with it i've already tried it so i know that it won't like react badly to my skin carve out my brows and i'll let you know if it burns or tingles or any of that but right now i don't feel anything i'm a wax girl i get my brows waxed all the time i don't like threading Threading hurts me. Ugh, all done. Okay, that didn't take too long at all. So I'm gonna just wait like five, six minutes. Um, from watching videos, apparently if like my hair goes into a wavy kind of zigzag motion, it means it's time to take it off. I think it's wavy. I don't know if you guys can see the zigzag. So I quickly washed my face. I used Glossier Milky Cleanser. It's really soft, really sensitive, and I, I just assumed it'd be perfect for this. So these are my brows afterwards, a difference, but there is still hair to be tweezed. So I'm gonna brush it up again, and I'm gonna tweeze these hairs. There's quite a bit of hair, so maybe I should have left it on for longer. I hate tweezing, I hate it. So difference i still need to pluck this one i lightly just shape this one up just to see if i like it i do so i'm going to do this brow and then do the exact same thing okay this is what we're dealing with at least i've got the shape that i want and i like my shape it's just the hair isn't really been picked up from the root if you guys can see but i think maybe keeping them on for longer will do the trick but anyway I'm about to take these braids out and wash my hair. Glow up done. Everyone can leave now. <laughs> I'm joking. Okay, so taking out my hair. I could actually do this type of hairstyle one day. I should without all my glue on my hair. Shower time. Play some music. <laughs> sweating from blow drying my hair but blow dried it straight as straight as it can be i don't think so but i could probably go over it again but i'm so this is draining me i was thinking should i um fake tan but i don't think i am but 
I will be taking these nails off because I can't stand to look at them any longer. So I'm gonna clip them, put them in some acetone and just soak them off basically. So I'm gonna have my little setup all here. I've got my stuff to cut my nails, cuticle oil, hand cream for afterwards, um, nail polish, acetone that I've used to soak off my nails and some cotton pads for the nail polish remover if I need so. Oh, also, I got some nail files. I'm just gonna link a bunch of videos so you guys can see how to do it yourself. I'm gonna watch some Grace and Frankie. I've got it already up. Whilst I soak off, I'm gonna do one hand and then come back and do the other. I realize I haven't made the screen full screen and I also kind of need to turn off the camera. So, um, yeah, okay, right? I finally done my nails. I didn't even do the thumb properly. I don't know if you guys can see. The thumb is so, ugh. this was the worst experience ever. I couldn't even show you guys, but the acetone was just taking forever. And because I don't have like the little drill where you can just get rid of a lot of, I don't know, the acrylic, it took me like a good two hours. It's now quarter to midnight. That is off my list. Tomorrow we do sugaring. I'm very scared for that as well, but I need to clean up this whole ass mess. Hello, it's like is it three days later two to three i don't know if you guys can tell i've tanned from when i last showed when i spoke to you guys um does it show though anyway i have okay i have oh, my hands are dry my so my lips let me cream them real quick but anyway today is all about my hair i'm doing hair removal on my body so my armpits you can see here. I decided to make a sugar wax. I've been seeing other people make on YouTube. So I was like, let me make my own. I watched a Kayla's video on how to make it. She used a microwave, so I did the same. And I'm gonna insert that here. So yeah, that did not work. So I ended up following another person's routine, um, another person's tutorial, oh, I forgot her name, will be up on the screen and linked down below so you guys can go check that out. And I did that and that may have worked. Still cooling down here it's a bit darker yeah it's a lot darker than I thought it'd be I think I kind of left it on too long but the consistency is very much there and then I'm gonna start using it for my underarms as well as like my stomach I get some hair in the lower part of my stomach I don't know if you guys can see this is very TMI but anyway I was like cool I want to wax that all off today because i shaved my down below yeah i know i shaved it's really bad but and i was like i don't know if i really want to do sugar waxing down there i feel like it'll just be really messy and like i feel like i need someone else to do it for me as well rip off the hairs and no not at a thank you or <laughs> anyone like recommends oh you're but no thank you all right i'm gonna take a bunch Too hot, too hot, too hot. I've definitely burnt myself. Oh my God, I've burnt myself. <laughs> I've burnt myself. Okay, a little longer to cool down. Fuck. Ouch. Oh, it's hard, okay. I might as well just pull this bit off. Ow, I've definitely burnt myself. Is it smart to, I don't know. <laughs> I don't wanna do it, I've burnt myself. Oh, it pulled out my hair. Okay, it works. It pulled out my hair. 
don't know if you guys can see that. You can see the hair. Okay, it definitely works. Whoa. Okay, <laughs> I'm excited. Oh, I just need this to cool down a little longer. Whoa, how about myself? Okay, I put some pseudocreme on it just because it actually is really hurting. I'm still gonna wax my armpits, I'm sorry, I'm still gonna do it. <laughs> okay, let's start off with my other arm. Okay, it's been absolutely ages, I'm getting tired now. I think I've missed opportunity, it's gone really hard. I can't put it in the microwave to soften up again. See, this is this is what I can't deal with. Either I burn myself or it hardens up. I'm gonna put it in the microwave. Okay, I need this shit over and done with. I'm gonna get the baby powder. Just to make sure it's nice and dry and it's got hair to pull on. Okay, we're back. I basically put it back in and got it to the right temperature because I think I overcooked the last one that was why I was really really hot so I've left it for 20 minutes I think it's ready we're gonna just go I'm gonna just do it Look at all that hair. Make sure you stretch out. Uh -oh. Stretch out. Keep. Pull. Okay. I'm getting there, I'm getting there. I am Helles. And smooth that was a whole load of difficulty um, tip is if you've got all this hair and if your hair still isn't all gone you can put it back into here reheat this for like 30 seconds to a minute which is what I did and then wait for it to cool and repeat the process however it just does make it all a bit long um, if I were to do this again I'd probably make a softer wax, so probably not heat it in for too long, and then um, get some wax strips and use it that way. So I've done the hard wax method, which doesn't pick up all the hairs. Like it does do a good job, but it, it could pick up the really, really small hairs. I find that it can't pick up. Um, will I still be going back to my wax lady? Absolutely. Um, and also, if you want to see a video on how I get my wax and tanning, which I'm going to do after I have dinner, then I will leave the video up here. So tanning as a black woman, wax, sugar waxing as a black woman, I'll leave it probably in the cards here or if not, down in the description box. So I was going to do like a tan. I had like all my tan stuff ready. Like I've never self tanned, but like I was just like, I'm going to do it. But then honestly, I don't know if I can be bothered. Like I'm already kind of tanned anyway from being out in the sun. And I think I'm just gonna give this a miss. I'm sorry to be boring, but I might change my mind tomorrow, but today I'm giving it a pass. I'm not that interested, not today. Hello guys, oh my God, it's been so long since I last like filmed this um, glow up transformation because honestly, uh, I was not motivated, especially because we're indoors for like, I've been indoors now since like March, it, we're in July, or almost in July next week, and I'm just like, why am I trying to force this glow up transformation? If I want to feel how I want to feel, if I want to be ugly for a little bit, then I'll be ugly for a little bit, like, I don't know why I'm trying to, I was trying so hard to try and like look cute indoors, which I can understand because it's like trying to be normal and stuff and like do what you normally would do at home and still be presentable because looking good makes you feel good and all of those things so i understand but like i was just like you know what uh this is also time to kind of take a break so i'm gonna do a second break and come back i haven't done my nails we can do my nails today but um definitely definitely need to do my hair i'm giving myself a haircut because i'm i'm sick and tired of my hair like um one second sick and tired of my straight ends of my hair like i just want this all to go um, and I want to just rock a fro. I'm just going to straighten my hair and then chop it. 
Let's begin. This is scary, I can't breathe. This is very scary. I don't know why I decided to do it by myself, but I'm here now, so. Chopping off all the dead ends, all of them. We're gonna keep going shorter. But so much already it just looks a lot thicker but I do want to get it like even shorter than this because my fronts <laughs> oh my gosh through the screen right now but yellow you know you only live once <laughs> who cares about her anyway not me <laughs> i'm really trying to convince myself she like my little at <laughs> the back <laughs> okay i'm starting to like it it looks good <laughs> i'm excited oh my god so i had to put in little clips because like when i say i'm sweating and like when someone in the UK says it's hot, it is hot. Like British weather is just so humid and just hot and there's no breeze, no cool air, nothing. It's just like literally being in a sauna. Like when it's hot here, it literally feels like being in a sauna. So like my edges are already frizzing up. I don't know why I expected them to even stay down in the first place. But I'm kind of scared to chop the back. But I know that I want the back to be a little bit longer than the front. I don't want it to be like that. I kind of want it to be like, I don't know. I feel like that will frame my face better. But it's hot. So I'm using this mirror. I've got two mirrors. I've got one mirror right here and one mirror right here. So I can kind of see the back of my head. Now. It was basically, yeah, before it was just the back, innit? You yeah. still got that door up. I look like door, I don't know. <laughs> it's a nice level cut, though. Hold on. Thank you. There's, well, these are scissors. You I just, no, no. I use like actual cutting scissors. What's the difference between these and 
these if i these are literally for like anything i use these to cut my eyelashes if i use these this could give me split ends that's what people said so if i use these it gives me more of a cleaner cut which it did only bells the explorer yeah come on bells the explorer well you got a style problem i just keep doing wanting yeah. to do this <laughs> Put it right back on. Right back on. Ooh, no, baby. Yes, yes. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Stiff work. Stiff work. For real, stiff work. Ooh, ooh. No work. Stiff work. Well. No. Yes, bitch. No stiff bitch. No, none of that. Shake bitch. What? Yeah. All that. <laughs> it's proper. Look at it in the mirror. Move <laughs> It's proper wobbling. wobbling. Oh, my day. Movement. Yeah, just style it correct, innit? <laughs> and then I'll judge it properly. You know. Yeah. It's so hot that I'm like, do I really wanna what? strain it right now? Cause like I'm Why you still got to strain it? Huh? Obviously to make it look nice. This isn't just how I'd have it. I'd have to bump the ends and make it look more clean. Yeah. Hello guys, it's been a minute. So like I said showed you guys last time, I chopped my hair, I styled it today, I'll show you guys clips and everything. I've been doing a lot of different styles with the short hair. This bob has really been everything to me i just did a top knot today just because i didn't want to put heat on my hair especially the front of my hair because i've been doing that recently so i just straightened the back put the top in the to top knot and that is basically it and then i did this little makeup look it's nothing crazy nothing special I've, i'm pretty sure i've done this makeup look before on my channel i'll link it down below if you want to know the details or maybe just the techniques because that's really important i've also got we're going to be doing some press on nails this is from a brand called fingered <laughs> um they're a black owned brand i actually bought these about three months ago and I specifically showed her the nails I wanted and she created them for me. And they weren't too expensive. They're 15 pounds, which I think is okay for exactly what I showed her. I showed her a picture. This is what she created for me. So I'm gonna do my nails. I've been really rocking like no nails. Well, no nails for like about three months. I've been really liking it. I can't even lie to you, but I want some length. And then we're gonna change into an outfit and then we're basically done for my little glow up. <laughs> But yeah, I've been seeing people, a lot of people have been doing press on nails. A lot of people have been doing the acrylics themselves. I don't have the patience, you guys know. Nails done. Talk to me nice. Show me the money. <laughs> I feel like just talking with my hands now so you guys can hear everything I'm saying. Do you see I got new nails? <laughs> and these are really, really long, but I wanted them this length. So the sun is gone in the UK, that's why I got my lights out. Well, lights out, lights on, as always. The UK weather is just so trash, but I'm so glad I've got my nails done. Anyway, let me change into a cute outfit. <laughs> I will include details for everything. The outfit I'm wearing is a little two-piece. Oops. Two-piece, which I actually think is a bit too small for me, especially for my boobs. They're literally coming out, but that's okay. I love this outfit. It's got this little asymmetric. I don't know where I'm going. Decided to be extra, extra, because this video has been coming for a long time. So I am clean, clean shame, clean waxed, hair did, nails did, talk to me nice. Hair did, makeup did, outfit check. I think we're basically done. I think I have glowed up as much as I can without not really doing too much, but still doing a lot. Cause where am I going? And you know what? Let's finish off with a perfume. This is a Kiali scent. It's the Deja Vu White Flower. It's like the, it's like sweet, floral, just goodness. I still like wearing fragrances when I'm in the house because I, I like to smell good. Yeah, so I think we're basically done. That is me done. I'm ready. I'm going to go take pictures so I can have a thumbnail. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. <laughs> Let me cover my booze before I get demonetized. And then catch you guys next time. Mwah. Bye.